Welcome to Academic Gain Tutorials. We are studying rational and irrational numbers. So in this video, we are going to solve a problem which states prove that root 2 is an irrational number. So let's move into the solution. In order to prove that root 2 is an irrational number, we have first assumed that root 2 is a rational number. So according to our assumption, if root 2 is a rational number, then root 2 should be equal to p divided by q, where q not equal to 0 and there are no common factors of p and q. Now if any one of these conditions that q not equal to 0 or there are no common factors of p and q, if these conditions are not fulfilled, then we can say that root 2 is not a rational number and it will automatically satisfy as an irrational number. So according to our assumption for now that root 2 is a rational number, we have that root 2 equals to p divided by q. Now squaring on both sides of this equation, we have root 2 whole square equals to p divided by q whole square. And solving on both sides of this equation, we get 2 equals to p square divided by q square. Now cross multiplying on this both sides of this equation, we have p square equals to twice q square. So we can see that p square has a value which is multiple of 2. So being a multiple of 2, we can say that the term p square is an even integer. So since the term p square is an even integer, so the uh, term p should also be an even integer. So this is our first equation which says that p is an even integer. Now let us assume that p is equal to twice m and in this equation if we square on both sides we get p square equals to twice m whole square which gives us p square equals to 4 m square. Now from this equation we have p square equal to twice q square. So putting the value of p square over here, we get 4m square equals to twice q square. Now for the convenience of calculation, we write 2 twice q square in the left hand side and 4m square on the right hand side. And then on the next line, we have q square equals to 4m square divided by 2. So 2 came here. So after that, 2 to the 4 so we have we have q square equals to twice m square now q square over here is also a multiple of 2 so we can say that q square is also an even integer and since q square is an even integer so we can also say that q is also an even integer now from this equation number 1 and equation number 2 we can see that both p and q are even integers and they both have a common factor which is 2. q has a common factor which is 2 and p also has a common factor which is 2. But this contradicts our assumptions that both of the terms p and q have no common factors. So since both these terms have a common factor which is 2 then we cannot say that root 2 is a rational number because this condition is not satisfied and since root 2 is not a rational number we can say that root 2 is an irrational number so we have proved that root 2 is an irrational number so that was the problem solved easily Thank you for watching this video.